money because he's promising you that I will never, I will not leave you. I will not forsake you. That womb will carry a child again. That womb will bear children. That womb will conceive because it is a womb of glory. It is a womb of glory. You will conceive, child of God. You will bear children for your husband because the Lord is telling you this morning, I will not leave you. I will not forsake you. Because yesterday, again, someone was praying. The Spirit of God was praying. He gave me a particular verse in the Bible. Psalm 55, verse 5. Psalm 55, verse 5. That was yesterday night. He said, fear and trembling come upon me. Horror overwhelms me. Why must, be, why must this be this case? Why must someone be afraid? Why must somebody be afraid of tomorrow? Your child of God, who is threatening you? Who is threatening you this morning? Who is making you scared? Who is making you afraid this day? Is it lack of money? Is it lack of money, child of God? Is it poverty? Is it stagnation? Is it failure in marriage? Is it fruitfulness? What is making you tremble this morning? What is making you to be afraid? Remember his words unto you this day? In Isaiah 41, he said, fear not, I will help you. Fear not, I will help you. And this morning he's confirming it by telling you, I will not leave you. I will forsake you. I will not leave you. I will not forsake you. The word of God is true. Because in the first verse of the, of the word, in Psalm 55, he says, Give ear to my prayer, O God, and hide not yourself from my plea for mercy. Yes, child of God, this morning, speak to God and say, O Lord my God, give ear to my prayer this morning, and do not, O Lord my God, forsake me this morning. Give ear to my prayer this morning. O Lord my God, do not forsake me. Yes, attend to me and answer me. I am restless in my complaints, and I mourn. Because of the noise of the enemy, because of the oppression of the wicked, your child of God, who is oppressing you, who is making you afraid, who has made you sad all this while? Is it conception? Is it lack of babies? Is it lack of money? Is it poverty? What is making you sad? What is making you think that God is not there? What is making you to feel that what God is telling you this morning, he will not do for you? Child of God, open your mouth this day and pray with his word in Psalm 55, verse 1 and 2. He said, give ear to my prayers, O God. Give ear to my prayers, O God. And hide not yourself from my plea for mercy. O Lord my God, this morning, give ear, O Lord my God, to the cries of your children this morning. Everyone that has gathered for prayer this morning, O Lord my God, give ear this day to their cries. Give ear this morning to their prayers. Grant them their heart desires, O God, I pray. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, my Lord. The voice said again, the word said in verse 2, attend to me and answer me, O God. Attend to us this morning and answer me. I am restless in my complaint and I mourn and cry because of the noise of the enemy, because of the oppression of the wicked. For they drop trouble upon me and in anger they bear a grudge against me. My heart is in anguish within me. The terrors of death have fallen upon me. Fear and tremble come upon me, and horror overwhelms me. Child of God, no matter what, the Lord is saying unto you, open your mouth this morning and pray. O oh Lord my God, answer me today. O oh Lord my God, answer me this morning. As your voice is going on, as your words are going on this morning, O oh Lord my God, be attentive to my cry this morning and answer me. Make it a prayer this morning, child of God. Make it a prayer this morning and say, O oh Lord my God, be attentive to my cry this day and answer me. You that answer Jabez, answer me this morning. You that answer Jabez, answer me this morning. Jabez was honorable. Jabez was honorable, but still he was living in sadness. Jabez was honorable, but still he was living in pain. Jabez was honorable. Still he was living in shame. But the day came that God said, enough is enough. And that day came when Jabez opened his mouth and began to pray. When Jabez opened his mouth in First Chronicles chapter 4, chapter 4, verse 10, Jabez cried unto the Lord, and God said, Jabez cried and said, Oh, that you may bless me. Oh, Lord, oh, that you may bless me and enlarge my God. Oh, that you may bless me and enlarge my cause. And the voice of God said that the Lord answered Jabez. The Lord blessed him. Child of God, this morning, do the same now. Do the same as you have come to the throne of grace. As you have come to the throne of grace, do this. 
cell. Do the 